All right, getting our week eight Rising Stars Conference battle done versus Beast Like. I believe this is the final week before playoffs, so I've already made playoffs, but still always got to do my best on the battles at least. Oh boy, and we got Ninetales coming out first to set up that drought. Willow Wisp. Aww. Ooh, now we're eating a fire blast. Alright, so either they're going to try and KO the Slurpuff, or they're going to eat an Endeavor. Alright, so now we got a sleeping nine tails. So I think we're just going to go straight for the uh, KO here. Question is, is what is he going to send in to try and get this thing uh, not KO'd? Ninetales swaps out, so we have a sleeping Ninetales and a Leafeon. Alright, if there's one thing that that Leafeon does not want to see on my side of the field, it is the Drapion. And I gotta try and preserve Seismitoad. Because I still need to get Stealth Rocks set up. Well, there goes the black sludge, which is unfortunate, but that's alright. Ooh, somebody has a life orb. Well, whatever he switches in isn't going to like the knockoff. Because I doubt he'll keep the Leafeon in. And the only one that may be able to outspeed uh, Drapion at this point, I think, is the Brave Yari. And that's mostly because I'm expecting it to be running a Choice Scarf. Alright, let's get some Toxic Spikes set up as well. I don't think he has a poison type to absorb toxic spikes.
And the sunlight's gone, which means Leafeon is now no longer capable of outspeeding Drapion, I believe. I might be wrong. I hope I'm not, but I might be. So, my guess is that he probably sends out Brave Yari next. Because that's the only safe thing that can come in right now. Yep. Let's see, and he's got a Gigantamax. Uh, unfortunately, I have nothing that I want to actually send in against this thing. You turn, huh? That's alright, let's see what he sends out now. Because he has to send something in, it's going to get toxic, and it's going to get uh, lowered speed as well. Alright, this Mimikyu is going to be a problem for me, though, right now. But, I'm pretty sure I can deal with it. We're gonna do Trope Kick and lower its attack stat. Cause I'm expecting a sword stance. No. Okay. That's fine. We're lowering this thing's attack. Oh, but it's defiance. That's not good. That's not good. He even suspected the uh, trope kick, I'm guessing, on that. Not sure what to do about this now. No point in keeping Serena up. Okay. Hmm. Honestly, I can't afford not to do this. All right. Still on thanks to the sash and Braviary is now done. So that's one main concern out. And everything else on this team will be affected by toxic spikes and sticky web. And what Pokemon do I have left? Because I still have to have something to be able to throw into that Mimikyu. Hmm. 
So here comes the Dynamax. <clears throat> now we got the giant UFO. All right. Either way, neither one of us is KOing the other. Which is a problem. I will KO this thing. Or at least I should be able to. But that's after turn two, and then Mimikyu gets a shot at me with Shadow Sneak. Right now, I think he's debating between moves. Is he going to try and stall out Gengar? Nope. I don't think he is, at least. There's that damage, but this thing's far bulkier than I am. And now he can't swap out. Yeah, we did about the same. Oh, you're kidding me.